Hey guys, it's Nikki from Still Moments Nursery. Just gonna do a box packing of Elizabeth Ann for her trip home. Elizabeth Ann is a custom water doll. Um, she was actually a remake of my original um, Elizabeth that I did of the Sally by Bonnie Brown doll kit. Uh, her mum fell in love with her so she wanted me to do an exact uh, replica of her. So um, as you can see she's um, exactly the same. So she's the Sally by Bonnie Brown uh, doll kit. Um, she has got alpaca hair, not uh, mohair, um, which is really, really, really soft. Um, and it's just, it turns out so nice um, on the babies. Uh, so she's got nice light brown uh, alpaca hair. Um, like I said, she's a Sally by Bonnie Brown doll kit. So she is a uh, limited edition uh, doll kit. So she's a very special baby. Um, I'm gonna send her home in a nice pink grow suit just to protect her uh, paintwork during her trip home. Uh, she's also got a lot of other goodies to go uh, in her box as well. So we'll go through them um, now for you. So to start off with, she's got a little white uh, beanie. She's also got a little Winnie the Pooh bib. I thought it would be nice for her because I love Winnie the Pooh. And she's also got a little bunny rabbit t-shirt. And a pair of spotty leggings. And I thought they'd go really nice under this little dress that I found for her. So I thought that would look really cute on her. So the leggings for the dress. And then I also found this gorgeous pair of pants. I love the little bows on them, so I thought she'd suit those really nicely. And just a little one piece romper uh, with a little ice cream on it. And I did her photos in this and she looked absolutely adorable. So that's her clothing. Oops. And she's also got a little pair of socks. And I like the little sneaker socks with the little bows on them. So she's got a pair of those. And I thought just a nice plain cream headband with a few little pearls on it would be nice and match all of her outfits. So I'll pop that into a bag. Um, again, she's got her little charms, just a few little charms that I've picked out. I picked out a little teddy bear one for her. Uh, this time and of course our business card so that's going to go into her order details put that over there um, her birth certificate and her care instructions will go home with her and she's also got a magnetic dummy so I've chosen it's a little, little princess on there and it's magnetic. And then I found these little calico bags that I'm going to put all the dummies in with my dolls. So they look really nice on the box. So that's her dummy. And just a little toy to go home with her. Uh, her mum can keep the key ring part on if she wants or she can remove that to have it just as a toy. And I thought that would suit her little outfit. So that's gonna go into her box as well. Uh, a little comb and brush set, just so her mum can keep the hair nice and soft and silky. And of course, a little bottle of conditioner as well. So it stays nice and soft. And of course, a little bottle of baby powder, just so she can sprinkle it on the baby. Um, I normally put it on the clothes just to make it smell uh, baby-like. So I've got those in the box. Um, some little friendship bracelets 
that I'm including just as a little gift for the mum. And then a baby card and I'm going to add in just a little note. I'll write in a little note for her mum when I do her final boxing. And then I've got these little birth announcement cards that I found. So I thought they'd be really nice just as a keepsake. So I'm going to write all of her details in the card for her mum. So I'm going to write on those. Of course she's got some nappies to go home with. So just picked out some nice plain white ones and some ones with a little print on it. And then for her blanket, I love the little spots on the blanket and I thought that would match her outfit nicely. So I'm gonna wrap her up in that. And I've got a few little ribbon ties just to tie around her, to keep the blanket in place. So if we start her boxing, I've got some nice paper here. So two different types of paper, just wrap up her clothing in. So we'll choose this one to start with. So the first one I might do her bib, her hat and her socks. And then I can put in the other ones in her other one. Okay. So there's one little package. And then for her clothing, wrap up. A little t-shirt. Her ice cream suit. Her pants. And her little dress. Okay, so there we go. Two packages to go into the box. Uh, I'm not going to wrap the brush, that's just going to go in like it is. Uh, so is her teddy and then her dummies. And for all these little items, just so they don't get lost, I'll put those into a little Ziploc bag. So the charm, her little headband. And a little friendship bracelet. Just like that. And then I might actually put in her birth announcement card in there just to keep those flat. I said I've got to write on that still, but just want to show you guys how it's going into the box. Okay, so that'll go in just like that. Uh, her certificate and care instructions. We go in another one. And I'll grab her order details and that will go in there as well. Okay, just like that. And then her baby powder and her mohair conditioner will go in the box. And her nappy and her card as well. Okay. And she's also got a belly plate as well. So the Sally 
My Body Brown doll kit came with a belly plate included. So I'm going to wrap that up in some soft tissue paper. that will go into the box just like that. So we'll wrap up Elizabeth. Hair's all nice and straight. Okay. Tuck in her little hands, just like that, and then I'll cover her little face and her toes. Okay, and then just hold the blanket in place. I think I'll use the white one. Okay, just like that. And tuck that in there. All right, so there she is all wrapped and ready to go into the box. Uh, I'll go and line her box with some nice tissue paper and we will be back to pack all of her goodies into her box. Okay guys, so I found some nice pink and white tissue paper. Um, I've lined her box, so let's start packing her ready for her trip home. So I'll pop her in first. And then with her nappies, I found just to add a little bit more protection, just gonna go around her head like that. And around her feet, just like that. And then her belly plate, I'll slip in down there. I might actually put another nappy in that corner just to protect that. And I've got her clothing. So I've got that. that fits up there nicely. So one and two. Uh, we've got her dummies. I just like to sit those on top. And I'm going to tuck her little teddy in there so she doesn't get lost. Uh, her brush. I'll pop that down side like that. It's all snuggly. Um, her mohair conditioner and her baby powder. Um, I'll put the mohair conditioner in a little bag, but that's going to sit down in there. That fits nicely. And her care instructions and her certificate. Now I want that to stay nice and flat. So I'll sit that down behind the brush, which will keep it nice and flat. Uh, her card and all the other little goodies that I put in the bag, I'm gonna put that over this side. And then her other little card, I'm gonna write in that, and that will go down the side like that. Um, I also found these cute little handmade with love little stickers. So once I've put over the tissue paper, I'm gonna seal it uh, with one of those. So I thought that would look really nice. 
Uh, so that's Elizabeth's box packing. So she's got all of her little goodies in there. Like I said, I'm going to put a few more nappies just to keep everything secure. Um, but anyway guys, wish her a safe journey home. Um, keep an eye out for her box packing or her box opening video. Um, I'm pretty sure her mum might do one. Um, but anyway guys, thanks for watching and I will talk to you soon. Bye. Okay, ready? Yep. Okay. So what was it, funny photos? Are you recording? Are you recording? Yes. So I can do one sec. <laughs> so how do you normally do the thumbnail? It's um... Well, now you're talking normal. Do that again. Sorry. <laughs> or with the thumbnail, um, where do you put the doll? Because you have your still when it's nursery, so you have your doll, so if I do something like this. So make sure I'm smiling and don't look like I'm grumpy. Like, yeah, no, because you're sort of No, what I'm saying is I can just go like. And no arms. Arm. Arm. Okay, click that. Click it. So where's your volume at? What do you mean where my volume at? I don't know where my volume's at. Hey, we're back! Look, I'm looking at you. Okay, Elizabeth yep. and your Sally by Bonnie Brown. Oh, how's it? Yes? Mm -hmm. Okay. That's good. So, guys, Elizabeth, Elizabeth and. <laughs> <laughs> When I prepared earlier. <laughs> you can say do that again. Right? <laughs> <laughs>